Well, we're back. It's Friday evening. Sun's going to go down. We are going to start the scott off, cook us something to eat. But tonight, it's supposed to snow. So right now, it's about, what, 50 degrees? Yeah. 50 degrees. And we found a this camp spot right here from last time. So we wanted to be in this spot. A lot of people canceled, so we don't have anybody next to us. It's all ours. And uh, tonight, it's going to be snow. About 18 inches of snow this weekend, maybe more. Yeah, we brought tonight. our sleds. It's just the two of us. Three to five tonight. And then yeah, it's going to be awesome to wake up tomorrow morning with nothing but a white blanket everywhere. And just enjoy the snow. Maybe hike in the snow. You know me. I love it. So this is what it looks like before. Snow. Yeah. See this area? Show you what we are cooking tonight found these right here at ralph's we haven't had these in a while chicken patties so i've got me some buffalo sauce and we're gonna make buffalo chicken sandwiches got some uh, peppers some cheese it's just sandwich bread lettuce from our garden and tomatoes from our garden so let me cook these up it's not going to take too long and uh get dinner going before it gets dark Go buffalo chicken sandwiches. My vegan bite buffalo chicken sandwich. Mm -hmm. Got Frank's red hot sauce, chickenless vegan patty, grilled onions, peppers, yeah. lettuce. This is great with some uh, vegan ranch as well. So there we go. Always satisfied. All right? Mm -hmm. Eating good in the wood. <laughs> in the woods. <laughs> All right, we've got our porter potty set up and we have our path back to our truck tent. We tried the vault toilets again just because they're closer to us but still didn't like it. This is much better to have your own. Alright, it is snowing like crazy up here and we ran into our first problem with not being prepared. We didn't bring a canopy, so what I do is I set up this makeshift canopy out of my rooftop cover over there and it's not that big. We tried to use the Coleman stove here to cook our uh, Beyond sausages and we can't do it because snow comes in from every direction. I mean I could probably get it done, it doesn't take long. but. Just with trying to get everything situated, we were getting snow covered, covering everything. So we're just making sandwiches. We are going to eat, we're not going to starve, but uh, that is our first problem that we ran into out of the fourth time up here because of the weather, but that's why we're doing it, so that we can learn and be more prepared next time. So I'm just going to get an enclosed canopy to bring out here maybe, or at least bring a tarp, and you can string it from the trees to make a bigger area. Uh, but a canopy with legs would work around this table or or around the bear box. You, know, you just need somewhere to cook with the Coleman stove or or a fire as soon as the uh, fires are allowed. That's all right though. We're just eat, eating the truck for now, and then uh, take a hike. We're gonna go explore down here and look around and do a little hike in the snow, and then come back and hopefully it'll let up so we can uh, break out the, uh, the stove, the cowboy grill. We brought sandwich stuff so we don't have to rely on the grill. 
So we're going to just make our sandwiches, eat in here, we got chips, and then afterwards, go for a hike or go sledding. Have some fun in the snow. All right, I'll do a radio check. I'll be back. Let's go explore. I want to look for some tracks. I want to see what kind of tracks I can find out here now that there's snow everywhere. Hey, bear. How many of y'all would set up a tent right here in the middle of the forest and camp? I would. Look at that, I was just over there and it was clear. Now it's coming in. Hey deer. Hey bear, this is deer. You made it back? No, I'm up here on the ridge looking down into a valley and it's beautiful up here. Just uh, looking for tracks. I'll head back soon. Safe travels. <laughs> Alright, so we made a decision to leave early because it is dropping below 20 and it's not letting up and I can't even cook outside. We did not bring a canopy or anything and we went inside our tent and there's icicles inside the tent. That's not good. Uh, so we weren't in there all day and it kind of gets moisture on the top and it's like ice in there. And uh, we brought a buddy heater but you can't use that inside the tent, especially the rooftop tent. If we had another area out here where we can run it and stay warm, that's great. Um, what I think I'm gonna do, um, I learned my lesson, right? Is bring our generator and run electric heater. And that would make it a lot easier, more comfortable, because my wife does have bad circulation, so she's getting cold. So we had to call it, and uh, we wrapped up, and we're heading home. It's about 3.30, I think. Oh, it's going on four. So we wanna get out here before it gets dark. And uh, who knows how far we'll make it. They might have the road shut down. So I'm going to say my goodbyes. And uh, we're leaving. Until next time. We ran into a little snow. Okay. <laughs>